All right, so welcome back to the channel. It is I, Jose Alfredo Sofos. <laughs> El Sofos, Jose Alfredo Ra. So I was making a live and then my battery died. So I guess like when you're using a computer, you should make sure it's fully charged when you're going live on Yahoo. I mean, <laughs> not Yahoo, YouTube. So this reading is for uh, the air signs, which are Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. So that's what that live was gonna be. So three cards already came out. Justice, Libra card, right? There is divine justice on your side. That means there's a balance. There's a balance to everything you're experiencing in your life, especially anything that has to do with like legal matters or just honest communication, right? Justice means that things are balancing out for you. Also the sword is down, which means you most likely, right? Made this decision, this, decision, this choice to bring in that sense of balance to your life. Libra. So we have the Ten of Pentacles, right? Which means that this could be something that is what is being restored, the balance, right? This is generational um, wealth. This is longevity. This is a family tree. So this is like having all of those things in your life, right? And you have a Ten of Swords. So this tells me that for some of you, right? If you're seeking this this ultimate happiness with the Ten of Pentacles, right? And you have the Ten of Swords, it means these are two chapters, right? Right here, 1010. So for a chapter of ultimate abundance and happiness, right? There has to be an ending to a chapter, right? Of not speaking your truth, right? Hiding how you're really feeling in your minds, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But this is Libra's card, so it could be even more for you. Right? There has to be an old, old way, mentally, of operating that has to end so newness can begin. Magician, which is saying, right? This is also a card of Mars and Mercury, if I'm not mistaken. Um, which is, make, like, you have to come to an understanding, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, that your mind and your actions together create right an energy that allows for you to manifest something in your life but only when that mercury and that mars placement right are working together because this is speaking into reality while using physical things to assist in that process with the magician right there are some things that you definitely want to change and it's telling you it's time for you to tap into the elements earth air fire water right your stability and your groundedness. How grounded to the earth, how grounded to your life do you feel, right? With the waters, how are your emotions, right? Are they like sweet running waters? Or is it like being out in the deep ocean, right? Where there's like no visibility of land and the waves are like 10, 15 feet like high and you're just there like on a, on a raft. What are your thoughts like? Are you holding on to thoughts that you don't need anymore? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And do you have that desire and that spark? Right? Do you have the strength to release the fear to change and bring positive change? Because you have to bring a balance with the two of pentacles. This is, right? You bringing in that balance. Just like the scales. Knight of Cups. You don't need to give, like, <laughs> you don't need to give your heart away, right? That easily. Queen of Cups. And that Knight of Cups. And then there's a King of Swords. So, this could be one in a connection where, like, you're, you also feel like there's someone who you want to present your your emotional self to with the Queen of Cups. Because you have this energy in you, Queen of Cups. So for some of you also, it's bringing in that balance. Remembering to be nurturing to yourself, to not give your love away so easily, right? Because the Queen of Cups, she knows her worth. She's uh, very intuitive too, right? So that means that you're able to tap in to a part of yourself to get all the answers you need to help yourself. King of Swords. 
Aries. There's a masculine energy there. Airy, this is Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. King of Swords. For some of you, the message is slightly different. It's in a connection, in a relationship, right? It's going to take both parties, right, to come together, right, and use some common sense, use some emotional empathy, right, to the side, how to put away things that are long overdue, unnecessary, so you can stay on this path, right, of forging this together, right, it takes when two people are thinking about the same thing, when two people are consciously working towards the same goal, it manifests twice as fast. And when there's a balance here, right? Them seeing a balance also, there's a yin and a yang. So, which means that it's almost like divine counterparts coming together, right? Or just someone has a divine feminine energy which is that creative energy somebody has the masculine the yang which is the action oriented but definitely a thinker all right final message for gemini libra and aquarius all right another sword here so seven of swords i always see that as be mindful of the words you use um, don't don't be so quick to give out so much information so easily, right? It's like if somebody asks you one question and then you answer that one question and then you start telling them more things that weren't weren't asked, right? Don't give more than what's needed or what's asked of. And five of pentacles, so five to a ten. So even if you're feeling like this right now. Like you're not sure of how can you make this happen, right? You're not sure if you can push through those doors and step into that new reality. You can't because it's the second card out, okay? Divinely supportive for you. This is that, right? You utilized the things, resources that you had to bring this you found an equilibrium, so you found like a balance in this card, right? This is two people looking at each other as mirrors. But, hmm, still feels like some things are left unsaid. Yeah, a lot of sword energy. It's an air sign reading, right? Gemini Libra Aquarius. So, all right. Somebody needs to say something. That's all I'm gonna say. So. Gemini Libra Aquarius, this was your reading, right? Da, 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 da. So, I'm Justin Epp, Long Life Prosperity, good health to you all. Remember, like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification, okay? Thank you for all your support. Again, that's a blessing.